Hello everyone, switched up there. And just quite recently, I saw something on my channel that I had reached reached 4,600 subscribers, nearly 5,000. I mean, come on! Did anyone, man, did anyone ever expect me to reach five, so nearly 5,000 so soon? Honestly, not in a million years. I thought maybe, perhaps a thousand or perhaps several hundred, a couple of hundreds, but but nearly 5,000. It is more, more than I, I can ask for. And also, the Q&A video. It will be made sometime this weekend, I hope. So far, there is at least a few more. There are at least two more days before this month is over. So, if anyone has any more questions to ask, you still have two days more to ask me questions. And um, yeah, that was basic. I kind of could say for now, but but nearly. 4,600 subscribers. It is a big milestone for me here. Because I never expect to have so many subscribers at this point. I thought maybe it could take another few years, perhaps two years, to even reach the 5,000 goal. But but it seems that is almost like in the reach of my hand. It's not so far away from the reach. It. I mean, it is. It is more, more than I can even ask for. But how much more can I ask for? The only I ask for is your support, your continuous. Of your requests, your comments, but otherwise, it's not much, 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 decent, much more I can ask for. Without your support, all your that, I probably have just stopped continuing my stories and sort of, sort of things. But, but since the request is still coming in, and and even that the subscriber numbers is still climbing up, even though I do lose a few subscribers daily, perhaps one or two, but I can't force anyone to stay behind to be one of my subscribers, but I understand if people doesn't want to want to be subscriber anymore, but I can't force them. If they don't want to be part anymore, that's up to them. But I'm still happy to have to reach 4,600 subscribers. I was hoping maybe that I could do um, some live stream or something, but unfortunately, I don't even know so much about live stream. And, uh, and since I had my first strike last year, which made this my opportunity or a possibility for live stream was uh, kind of a little bit uh, shut down for at least three months. But since three months have passed since then, more than three months actually, now I do have an opportunity to do a live stream, but I decided not to. And the reason is I the reason is why I don't don't do it yet. It is not that I'm not as a camera shy or something. I have done a face reveal before on my channel, so that's not that, that, that not that as an issue. It's just that I don't even know so much about live streaming. Even if I did read a lot about it, I'm not so sure how to how you say it um, understand about it. But otherwise, 
it is just something that I really want to try someday. Perhaps when I have more skills and knowledge how to operate a, a live stream. But I don't think that it is perhaps so far distant future. I know that some of my some of my subscribers and some of my friends here have actually been doing some live streams. I'm not as a, a busy person, it depends from the time to time, but otherwise I can't just not thank you all for this great number of subscribers for nearly more than 10 years now. It is beyond any of my dreams. And before I end this video, I'm going to reveal that I'm going to take doing some other special video, but it will be uploaded sometime after my Q&A result video is up. And that video is actually going to be a challenge video. But I won't reveal exactly what kind of challenge it is. So far, I have only been told one person about it, and I know that person won't reveal any information either about this. So until then, I hope you all is feeling okay, and that you all are great at the moment. I know that some of my subscribers or followers from the United States has been having, well, some bad weather lately, the storms, and about a few weeks ago when this extreme sub-zero level of temperature was completely shocked to me, at the same time Australia had an extremely heat wave going on, warmer than it usually is. But I'm just Happy to see many of my subscribers and my fans are still here and not and also unharmed by this unusual weather this winter. And I can say that we here in Sweden we had still less on so winter in the north, but but in south it is a bit warmer. There has been a little bit warmer than, than usually. Today, <clears throat> today it has actually been one of the warmest days, well, in the part of the region I live, has been about 53 Fahrenheit, which is not as much as than usually, but it seems the warmest in this region by, well, or the warmest temperature in this particular month of this year, part of this, part of this year, is actually 60 Fahrenheit, which is Unusually, the last winter was not as, as much as that cold, but last summer, that is a summer I will never, never forget. I just hope this year won't be that as a living oven heat. Well, everyone. And if you have your opinion, thoughts, or any you want to say, tell me something, just leave it in the comment section below. And as always, subscribe, leave a comment, and as always, this is Switch Channel over and out.